What's up ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the vlog. Um, so Frank and I have decided to go on a little hike. Uh, we're pretty much back in the same area that we were in yesterday because it seems like there's a lot to explore over here. And it's I mean, beautiful. And it's beautiful. There's mountains <laughs> everywhere. Apparently this uh, trail leads to a set of falls. I don't really know what to expect. Hopefully there actually is water there. I have uh, no idea. But <laughs> we're going to try and get down there. Um, it's pretty crazy. Like, look at all that. Wow. And I think there's an abandoned property somewhere down there too. <laughs> but I don't know if I'm going to go to that. Um, and then we're going to probably just do some randonautica later on. Keep exploring the area. See what it is that we find. Okay. Looking pretty interesting so far. Yeah. At least it's not like just a straight drop down. Otherwise, I think we might die. But the views, man, the views—that's what I—that's what I'm here for. Yeah. Look at those views. Wow, and it's so quiet. We'll probably run into like a, a random cow or something at some point. I wouldn't be surprised. Yeah. It happened. No uh, I'm sure they're around. Mountain lions, lion mountain. <laughs> lion mountains. Lion mountain, mountain lions. Hill mountain lions. Hill lions. <laughs> hill tigers. Or the New Mexico hill tigers. It's a new breed. Take my word for it. So that's pretty cool down there. It kind of looks like there's a wall, doesn't it? Oh yeah, it does. Yeah, it literally looks like a naturally made wall. <laughs> that's uh, pretty cool. And it's funny too, because it's like raining down there, but here is okay. Hopefully it stays down there. Yeah. It's probably just because the mountains all the way in the back down there are yeah. just higher up. I hear people. Yeah. Oh, there's people. Oh my God. You want to take the shortcut? What? Just down Yeah, there, like just roll. Just tuck and roll. Tuck and roll? Tuck and roll. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's not that big of a deal. <laughs> so we found, uh, we made some friends. There's like a whole herd of ants. It's really cool to like just watch how they move. Like, look at that. I wonder which way their home is though. Because I see them going both ways. It's just they work so systematically. It's really amazing. <laughs> okay, so apparently there is a waterfall down there. Uh, not too far, actually. And then there's a huge canyon, which apparently you can just get lost in because it's just so beautiful, um, etc., etc. We also made some friends, actual human friends, <laughs> on the way down who gave us some info of what to look for. Um, so, yeah. Okay, so we're coming up to the... Uh, crossroads and uh me and frank were just laughing because i was saying how one of these days i gotta come to new mexico for about a month like one month in new mexico and like one month in arizona around this time would be perfect because it's not super hot so you can do a lot and uh it's just funny oh look at that that looks really cool <laughs> There's like an actual canyon that runs all the way. That's the Soldado Canyon. So there's two ways. Um, canyon's that way. Falls, I believe, is this way. Um, but yeah, we were laughing because I'm like, when we come here, it's like you go up one mountain because we're only here for three days. So you went up one mountain, basically. And we're like, it was so nice that we decided to come back. <laughs> so, and there were so many other things that we could do as well, but you got to be a little selective with your time, of course. Um, oh, look, more doo-doo. Okay, let's head to the falls. Yeah, I think that's water. Either water or we're getting nuked. One or the other. Oh, <laughs> yeah, we're definitely getting nuked. Oh no. <laughs> Take cover! <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Just pick a spot. <laughs> so we're a little confused at this point. Um, yeah, we think it's this way. It looks like this goes all the way to it. Walk yeah, it goes around. It's like what we found last night. Yeah, definitely this way. I wonder why they do this. To keep the animals out. Or the animals in. I would assume, see? Whatever that is, is a big mother <laughs> Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Wow. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so clearly we are not alone. What the f Dude, there's literally a car down there. <laughs> That's random. Wow. What? How did that even get here? I don't know. I don't know how to get down there. And it looks pretty wet too. I don't really have. Wow. That's intense though. Yeah. There must be more. If there's one, there's gotta be more. 
That was a cool find. I think we're getting close to it. There's also a building up there. I'm pretty sure it's probably abandoned. Looks like abandoned. Yeah, no idea what the hell happened here. Like why it would be abandoned, but I mean, we did find a random car. There's something stuck in the dirt. Looks like a tire. Yeah. yeah. So there must be more. Maybe everything got like washed out or something at some point. I don't know, that car's a little hard to find. Yeah. Is this the right way? I don't even know if this is the right way. Oh, dude. Oh, what the yeah. It's the dude's abandoned property. Up there too. Huh? Up there, a hole. Yeah, I know. Did we just go the wrong way? <laughs> coming down from the yeah, I know. I think we were supposed to go up the other trail. There's another trail back that way. Well, the falls, as it sounds, is that way. Yeah. There's water flowing this way uh, for you to get across with your shoes. Yeah, whatever. It's gonna be right. mucky. <laughs> I don't know where the hell we're going. Well, I guess it's coming from there somewhere. Nice. Wow, what the hell? <laughs> this was quite a surprise. Yeah. Well, just gotta go through this way. And then up. And we're at the falls. Hmm, little mini waterfall. Look at that. <laughs> cool. nice it's cute yeah apparently it used to be one of like the nicest places to come i mean i imagine certain times of the year there's probably more water especially after the frost oh, yeah. and everything starts melting and just all starts flowing that's cool all right well we'll try and get to the top and then uh we'll see if we can check that area out too well it looks like we made it wow Pretty cool sight. These bushes weren't in my damn way. <laughs> oh yeah. Bushes is like, it's like really flowing. Yeah, it's still really cool though. It's like all red too. Wow. Oh look at that. You can see that a lot better from here too. So we got a little bit closer for a better view. So you can actually see where the water is coming down from a little better. That's awesome. So peaceful. I like it. Well, this is random, but uh, apparently it's wide open. So walk right in. Well, that thing is history. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean they're all pretty much down. You can kind of see them. I don't know what this thing was. I don't know. Some type of thing. Yeah, I guess it used to be somebody's house, but pretty random that every time we come out like near waterfalls in New Mexico, apparently there's a little abandoned house or town or something. Pretty cool. All right, let's. Uh, I guess we might as well start heading back. I think it's about to rain soon. Okay, so we're uh, walking towards Soldado Canyon. This is a bridge, I think. Yeah, I think so. What? Maybe, or stairs or something. <laughs> yeah, it kind of looks like it was a bridge, but we're going to head in this direction and uh, see what else we find. I'm actually surprised we haven't seen any wildlife whatsoever. Not really, not a few birds. No, lots of dung everywhere, but no actual animals, which is surprising. But we're bound to run into something eventually. Probably a snake or scorpion or something we found some wildlife we found a little gecko oh, i didn't even see yeah, it he's just chilling there on the rock there's also something in that bush heard it moving around so okay moving along here <laughs> but uh see i said we'd find something and we did gecko counts. he counts he's living his best gecko life now we're entering the uh canyon area you hear all the water trickling? Oh, you can actually see it from here. It's just all kind of pooling over there. Uh, okay, let's see what else might be down this way. I love nature. It's just so relaxing and enjoyable. Lots to see. Um, it's a good break from the city. The city life, you know? Well, it looks like we've uh, 
walked out to a more open area. Uh, yeah, it goes right into the canyon. Oh, there's the trestle thing. So there's another trail down that way. Well, it's the continuation of this trail, but we can probably drive down there and then like walk down to it, hopefully, um, before, you know, it gets dark. We only got a couple hours left, so I guess we might as well do that. Now, for the fun part, going back up this uh, steep ass trail. <laughs> Hopefully it doesn't take too long, probably like 15, 20 minutes. And then we can head over to another spot. Okay, ready for the next hike? Yeah. You, yeah? Yeah. You don't sound motivated. My legs are burning. Oh, already? My calves. We barely even did like a mile. <laughs> we definitely went over that. <laughs> we we definitely went so. over that. No, no, I don't think so. Cause it was a quarter mile, but it's because of the elevation going up and down. But uh, we're going on the other side of the, I, I kept saying Soldado Canyon. It's so, Salado Canyon. Okay, so apparently there's a trestle somewhere down there, about a half a mile from here. So we're gonna try and hopefully get there before the sundown. Uh, but I did bring all my lights with me just in case, because we don't want to get stuck out there in the dark. That would suck. What does the sign say? This way. This way. Uh, trestle is half a mile this way. Well, that's the seating. That one said half a mile. This one says half a mile too. Are we just going to come up to every single sign that says half a mile and just keep going? <laughs> I mean, I did see it at some point. I think, uh, I think it's like down there somewhere. I don't, uh, I don't remember. I just remember driving to some point and I'm like, oh, there it is. Got some like crazy looking webs in there. I don't know if those are like moth webs or some really big ass spider webs. <laughs> It's pretty intense. Haven't really seen too much out here. The other trail was better. Um, we had definitely had a better view, but once we get further in, it might change a little. Hmm. Oh my god, a rattlesnake! Ha, just kidding. <laughs> got him. <laughs> oh my god, a rattlesnake, for real. <laughs> Trust me, I'd probably scream a lot louder than that. <laughs> more of a watch out! Yeah. <laughs> Where's a prickly pear? Well, the sign says there's prickly pears. Oh. Yeah, we should find some. I would love to eat That'd one. That'd be delicious. We have knives, so we can cut it on the yeah. spot. And you gotta burn off the little spines. That, yeah. Those, those little nubs, you're supposed to use a lighter. And oh, okay. So cool. it doesn't go in your finger. But uh, check out this rock. It's a fascinating rock. Okay, let's move along here. Um, off to the trestle. So I think that might be the trestle. Uh, we got some history on it once we kind of come up to it. But... Uh, yeah, I don't know what it was used for. It kind of looks pretty cool. I don't know if it's a trestle or just a random bridge, but I'm pretty sure that's it. Has to be. Because we've probably walked almost a quarter mile at this point. Well, we've made it to the trestle. That's all the info. So yeah, I guess they converted it into like a bridge. Well, this is, fair. This is all new wood. Yeah. They must have just repaired it recently. Yeah. It's you not the... Uh... It's all like the old wood and some... Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's not the uh, original 1898 structure, <laughs> it looks like, but it looks pretty cool though. It's amazing that a railroad used to like be here at some point in time. Maybe that's why that thing all the way down there is completely abandoned, because they just had no use for anything anymore after they tore everything up. Very cool. So we decided to start heading back. Um, since the sun is going down, as you can see. It's getting dark. Yep, it's starting to get a little dark. Not too, too dark, but just the beginning. So we're gonna head out and uh, probably get ready for some randonautica. And yeah, tomorrow we're gonna be heading to Phoenix, Arizona. It's gonna be hot AF. Um, <laughs> well, tomorrow won't be so bad, but progressively into the week, it'll be getting hotter and hotter. And at some point it'll probably be like 95. <laughs> So, but it's okay. We like that weather. Well, I do. I don't know if Frank can handle it. I do. I like it. I'm an yeah. asphalt worker naturally. Uh -huh. um, yeah, so we'll see you guys in a bit. <laughs> we, uh, <laughs> we're on our way out. We found some random little animal. I'm going to get some sort of lizard. Yeah, it's definitely a sort of like a type of gecko or something. I thought it was a frog at first, but. Yeah, he like blended right into the rock. Yeah. I'm surprised you even noticed that. <laughs> That's cool. Hello, little guy. He's a little fatty. Yeah. What have you been eating? <laughs> like, for real. Okay.